It's happening. The signs of the last day's prophecies are happening just as Bible prophecy foretold. And it's revealing that we are nearing the end of this age of grace and the appearance of Lord Jesus Christ for his church. Thank you so much for being a part of this Last Days Church community here on this ministry channel of Signs of the Last Days. And thanks to all of you who are supporting this Signs of the Last Days ministry with your prayers and with your offerings. You praying and you giving is what supports this ministry to continue as we are here watching with you and praying with you as the signs of the last day's prophecies reveal. We are nearing the appearance of Lord Jesus Christ for his church and it's time to prepare now. There's news from around the world how that the earth is groaning and is breaking open to where even continents are beginning to split as the earth is nearing the reckoning day of the coming of the Lord Jesus. And the Bible prophecies foretell that when he will return to earth, that there will be massive cracks open up on the earth to where even at Jerusalem, the Mount of Olives will crack open, forming a great valley. Reports now reveal how that the earth is in travail, with it groaning, with it actually opening up in places around the world, with the earth seemingly preparing for prophecy fulfillment. For example, seismologists say that they have detected a seismic groan that keeps pulsating up from the deep of the earth, like clockwork. But the scientists say that they're not sure what's causing this mysterious phenomenon. One seismologist said that we're still waiting for the fundamental explanation of the cause of this phenomenon. And he said that I think the point is that there are very interesting fundamental phenomena in the earth that are known to exist out there but still remain secret. And in the Holy Bible prophecies, the prophet Daniel said that the Lord God is the keeper of secrets and he reveals deep and secret things. And reports say that there are cracks being discovered at the border of the earth's tectonic plates to where fault lines are in position where there could be significant movement to happen causing tears in the earth's crust. Geologists say that there are hundreds of what they call weak spots that have been realized along rifts in the earth with these zones of weakness between the tectonic plates running along and through the continents. This is not an isolated phenomenon as cracks are opening up in the earth that have been observed in various places in the world. Reports say cracks have opened up in the earth which stretch through the Mojave Desert between the sin cities of Los Angeles and Las Vegas that are so big that these cracks can be seen from space. It was reported that hundreds of homes were destroyed in Uganda as big ruptures opened up in the earth cracking roads and bridges and with the earth opening up and swallowing up houses. Large cracks and sinkholes have opened up in the earth in Iran at the capital city of Tehran where authorities have admitted that the area around Tehran is sinking as this country of ancient Persia, which is in the last day's prophecies, is causing havoc in the Middle East. And there was an enormous crack in the earth that suddenly opened up in Arizona in the desert of the southwest that the, US, uh, that the Arizona Geological Survey said was two miles long and that it was continuing to grow both in length and width not too far from Phoenix. A huge crack was reported to have also opened up in Wyoming, making a deep gash in the Bighorn Mountains where it was discovered by an outfitting and guide company on a ranch with them scratching their heads over this incredible and mysterious scene, which they said in some places resembled a mini Grand Canyon. And enormous cracks in the earth have opened up near the border of Turkey and Syria, where one of the cracks stretched for 100 
and 90 miles running through towns in a northeastern direction from the northeastern tip of the Mediterranean Sea. And in Mexico, authorities have reported how that local residents described to them peculiar and unusual natural phenomenon where the eyewitnesses said they had discovered huge cracks and it opened up in the earth with them growing for kilometers across the desert. Officials said that the exact cause of the phenomenon was unknown. And in East Africa, the earth is groaning and opening up to where it is even splitting the continent to where landlocked countries as Ethiopia and others are having the earth splitting open, going toward the sea, where there was a giant crack in the earth that opened up almost overnight. That was initially 50 feet deep and up to 65 feet across, slicing through highways and towns, terrifying many who live in that area, where one person said that they were having dinner with the rest of their family when the earth suddenly opened up beneath their feet and cut their home in two as they were in it. Also, in the heart of Siberia, there was a gaping chasm that opened up in the earth. That report said that was at least a mile long and had reached depths of about 400 feet that appeared without warning and was still growing where local residents there are said to be calling it a gateway to the underworld. In India, there were cracks reported to have opened up in the ground of the earth that they said were about 666 feet in depth that had flames of fire coming up out of them from the earth. And the revelation prophecies of the Holy Bible foretell the end time describing how the earth will crack open to where the bottomless pit will open up upon the earth, where it belches out smoke like from a great furnace which will release hideous demonic creatures that will torment humanity, described like scorpion locusts striking humans, making them deathly sick, who have a king over them that is the angel of the bottomless pit. Reports are revealing that the earth is in travail and groaning, opening up in places around the earth, with the earth seemingly preparing for end-time prophecy fulfillment, where in the near future, the actual geography and topography of the earth will be radically changed as described in Revelation Bible prophecy, where the prophecy describes how that there will be a global phenomenon of a great earthquake where just not one or a few, but the prophecy says every mountain and island will be moved out of its place upon the earth. The unimaginable is beginning to prepare to happen on the earth. And the Bible prophecies foretold that there would be groans and strains within the earth in the last days. The Bible prophecy in Romans chapter 8 describes that the whole of creation will groan and labor within itself as like convulsing with the birth pangs of labor. The prophecy says that it will be happening in earnest expectation for the revealing of the sons of God when the glory of Christ shall be revealed in us at the appearance of Lord Jesus Christ for his church. These events and conditions happening now in the world, they are connecting directly to the end time as warning signs pointing to the nearing fulfillment of the last day's prophecies at the end of this age. And it's revealing that it's time to prepare now for the nearing appearance of Lord Jesus Christ for his church by obeying the commandment of the Lord Jesus in John chapter 3, verse 3 through 5, where Lord Jesus said, unless you are born again, you cannot see the kingdom of God, and that you must be born again of the water and spirit. 
or one cannot enter the kingdom of God. And Lord Jesus authorized only his chosen apostle to tell us how to be born again. In Matthew chapter 16 and verse 19, where he gave his apostle the keys of the kingdom of heaven, with Lord Jesus saying that what his apostle preached was bound are recorded in heaven, which is eternal for his church. And the apostles in the acts of their preaching told us how to be born again of water and spirit as Lord Jesus commanded we must, where they preached the water baptism in the name of Lord Jesus for the remission of sin and being filled with the Holy Spirit of the Lord Jesus Christ. They preached it in Acts chapter 2 when Lord Jesus started his church in Jerusalem. In Acts chapter 10, when Lord Jesus started his church among the Gentiles. And in Acts chapter 19, as he spread his church among the nations. Please be looking for our next Watch and Pray live stream. As our Watch and Pray live stream on Sunday evenings, where we plan to share then more signs of the last day's prophecies. Please make sure you're subscribed to and following this channel and click the bell to get all notifications for our live streams and videos. There are so many significant signs happening now in world events, and they are telling us as believers of Lord Jesus to keep looking up for the signs show that our redemption is drawing near. So Upon the eastern sky.